Hello Pisces, welcome to a bonus love reading. This is going to be a how they feel about you love reading. As always, it's meant to be a general love reading, so it will not resonate with every Pisces watching. So just take what resonates for you, what applies to your situation. Feel free to check out your other placements. I'll have the playlist for all of the other signs linked in the description box. I lost my card. Um, this reading will be about how your person is currently thinking, feeling about you, what their energies are towards you, and what you need to know. What you need to know. Okay. Spirits, angels, guides, messages, guidance, please, for Pisces. What are this person's thoughts, feelings, energies towards Pisces? Person Pisces is dealing with or connecting with. You are always on my mind. I see you in my dreams. Interesting. So someone's thinking about you, Pisces. Uh, dreaming of you. Um, always, you know, you're 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 in their mind on their mind a lot. Let's see what else we get. What else can you tell me for Pisces? What else can you tell me for, for Pisces? What is this person thinking, feeling when it comes to Pisces? The person they're dealing with, connecting with at this time. What are they thinking, feeling? Words, Pisces. Words can express how much I care for you. You know, it fascinates me. I have um, 50 cards in my Stellar Soulmate deck, and I always get the same ones <laughs> for all the other signs. Very similar ones. Um, I compare everyone I meet to you is at the bottom of the deck. So that one has come up for other signs as well. Words can express how much I care for you. So there's a lot of feelings here, Pisces. Um, let's see what else we got. What else do we need to know about this person? Person that Pisces is or will be dealing with spirit. What, what do we need to know about their energies towards Pisces? What do we need to know about their energies? Thoughts. Moving forward. Okay, can I get one more? Get one more. What are their energies, thoughts towards Pisces or this connection? What are they thinking, feeling? past life moving forward into a new chapter you have had a connection with this person in the past interesting so i feel like something must have happened um either one of you left this connection and is still thinking about the past or someone wants to move forward with the past can you get some insight please for pisces insight guidance please for pisces what is this person that pisces is dealing with or connecting with at this time what are their thoughts energies intentions feelings towards pisces i keep seeing the eight of cups reverse okay so let's see pisces what we get for you in their what they're thinking or feeling right now position we got the seven of pentacles death reversed Scorpio energy. Interesting. It's almost like someone's resisting an ending or a change or does not want something to end or change or wants to delay an ending, despite the fact that they don't know how it's going to turn out with the seven of pentacles. There's doubt, um, uncertainty about something being successful. Okay. So what do you need to know? The magician reversed king of swords reverse yikes i do not like these two energies together because i think of a manipulative energy that uses communication to their advantage i hope i'm wrong about that we'll see when we clarify okay and what are their true intentions towards you or next actions the emperor reversed aries energy the five of pentacles yes so unfortunately bottom of the deck three of swords i think this is going to be one of those readings pisces where um i don't think things are going well for someone here and it could very well be the approach they take you know something happened between you to make someone feel pain heartbreak disappointment with this three of swords and I feel like they want to do something about it here with the magician reverse. 
the Emperor reverse, but you know, these two energies are almost energies that are trying to control a situation too much, trying to influence the outcome of something too much, and it might backfire. Clarity, please, guidance for Pisces. Give me some insight, please, Spirit, into these energies for Pisces. Okay, so let's get some insight here into the um, what they're thinking or feeling. Seven of Pentacles, Death Reverse. Can you tell me more about this spirit? Seven of Pentacles and Death Reverse. The High Priestess. Seven of Pentacles, Death Reverse. What can you tell me about these energies, spirit? What can you tell me about these energies? The Sun, interesting. Um, a secret coming to light, something being seen very clearly, something no longer being hidden with the high priestess and the sun. What else do I need to know? What else can you tell me, spirit, about the seven of pentacles, death, reverse, temperance, Sagittarius energy. So what I'm getting here, someone got found out or something here happened between you to cause a possible ending and someone I feel is trying to fix this. The chariot cancer energy at the bottom of the deck and these are all major arcanas which tells me that this is someone major energy shifts so i feel like this is someone that's very determined they're thinking about this a lot you're always on my mind i see you in my dreams sagittarius energy scorpio energy cancer energy strongly here i feel like someone's trying to fix a mistake they want to move forward they want to move past this. Okay, so what do you need to know? Let's look at the Magician Reverse with the King of Swords Reverse. I don't like these two energies together. So I want to get some insight. What, what's going on with the Magician Reverse and the King of Swords Reverse Spirit? What's going on here with the Magician Reverse, King of Swords Reverse, Ace of Swords? Tell me about the Magician Reverse, King of Swords Reverse. page of cups and the moon yep Pisces energy there you are Pisces um, and there's a magician upright so what I'm getting here is a conversation that is not what it seems which was my fear this was kind of what I feared here because I feel like this is someone who you know ace of swords page of cups great energy but then I have the moon here there's uncertainty there's something hidden there's there's an illusion perhaps or something that's not very clear. So what I'm getting here is like someone that's not telling you everything. Or whatever they're telling you, there's more to it than meets the eye. And you know, they're doing this on purpose because they're tr they have a goal. They want to get something done here with the magician. So be very careful if this person does decide to approach you or talk to you. Okay, so let's look at what do you need to know in terms of their true intentions towards you or next actions. Um, I feel like this person is having difficulties. The Emperor Reverse and the Five of Pentacles. The Emperor Reverse is someone that cannot get control over the situation. The situation is out of hand. They have lost their power. Um, they feel powerless. The Emperor Reverse for me as a reader is also someone who tries to force something too much and it backfires or they actually lose control altogether. Um, it's like they can't seem to bring something um, to order or whatnot. And then I have the Five of Pentacles, which is a card about difficulty, struggle, being out in the cold. So I feel like something's not gonna work out for someone here. Tell me about the Emperor Reverse and the Five of Pentacles. What do we need to know, Spirit, about these energies for Pisces? Three of Wands. What do we need to know about these energies for Pisces? Queen of Cups, interesting. What do we need to know? Can I get one more, please? For the Emperor Reverse and the Five of Pentacles. The devil, Capricorn energy. 
So this is what I'm seeing, uh, Pisces, Queen of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Um, I feel like this is someone who, you know, and it could be very well be that they're not trying to be manipulative. Let's give them the benefit of the doubt. Um, I think I think that they're just so focused on fixing whatever happened that they're trying to be extra strategic and maybe even clever, right? Maybe they're thinking, I can't, I can't just put it all out there. You know, I have to be careful what I tell Pisces because this could get worse before, you know, instead of getting better, right? I can make the situation much worse. And so I feel like they're waiting here or perhaps their actions make it so that they're waiting for something to happen here with the person they care about. I feel like you are this queen of cups. Um, and I think there is almost like this desperate energy from your person with the devil where they're waiting for you. They want this to work out, but they're just not, it's just not working out for them. It could very well be that you have completely shut off, shut down this person. Maybe you have d distanced yourself from this person, removed access. You know, this person sees you in their dreams and thinks about you, but I don't think they have access to you, perhaps, um, because this is someone on the outside, right? And I feel like with Emperor Reverse, it's almost like maybe they made a huge mistake and maybe they haven't learned from that mistake just yet. Um, can I get some insight into the three of wands? Can I get a little bit more information about the three of wands? This one, ace of wands, yeah. See, they're waiting for something to begin again. Um, I really feel like they want to, yeah, they probably want to talk to you, ace of swords, queen of swords, page of cups. Um, they probably want to talk to you, but look what's behind that, the Seven of Swords. So it's almost like a strategic conversation. Um, that's what I see. So, you know, from, from the energy that I'm picking up, that's what I see. Let's get a Stellar Guidance Oracle. Can I get some insight, wisdom, guidance for Pisces Spirit? Any guidance for Pisces? Any messages, guidance, please? for Pisces. Half faith. And bottom of the deck, think carefully. So interesting, half faith, think carefully. I feel like this is something that spirit would have to help you with. Um, if this person were to approach you, I think spirit wants you to really think about the situation, use your intuition, trust in spirit to guide you. That's what I have for you, Pisces. I hope you enjoyed this, um, how they feel about you bonus reading. Uh, if you did enjoy the reading, please consider hitting the like button, subscribing, um, so you can see more videos from me. It's a free way to support the channel. Uh, thank you so much for all of your support, for all of you that like and share and subscribe. I really appreciate it. If you'd like to leave me a comment sharing how the story resonated or just say hello, uh, feel free to do so in the comment section. I'd love to hear from you and I will see you all in another video very soon. Take care.